POC Creating the proof of concept Why and how The purpose Test the technical abilities, limitation and performance of the technological implementations needed for the app to work properly. If your app is expected to serve thousands of people at the same time with a specific remote service, you should also make sure this service is up for the task. If the app is expected to run functions which demand a lot of resources locally, you should make sure it is supported by the range of devices being offered today, including the older ones that are still in use by many people around the world. Graphics are not important to test unless they are unique and function as a core functionality for the app. UI is usually not important at all for the POC version and should be kept to a minimum so that there is no need to spend time on button designs, splash screens, uh, etc. Why do we need a POC? Let's just build the app! A lot of the time we get excited about an idea so much that we go ahead and start designing a version 1.0 up to the most technical details and then starting to implement it straight away. That's of course a mistake. The very first initial version of the app should be a proof of concept. We need to prove the concept of the app to prove it is viable to implement. For this, we are listing the core functionality on which it relies on and is essential for its success. For example, let's have a look at my app, Sandro. It's a very straightforward app, right? Does it need a POC? Yes. Are the graphics part of the core functionality? Only the drawing part, yeah. So the POC of Sandro's functionality included a simple drawing screen which looks realistic and works properly with decent performance while drawing, a save picture button, an add a seashell button which simply adds a PNG image to the drawing, and the ability to play a transparent video on top of the drawing and wipe it gradually in order for the app to be able to play a wave which wipes out the drawing, which is a basic need for the app. Since it was my first app, I definitely did not know if and how it would work, therefore the POC helped me to make sure I don't run into a deal breaker problem that will cause a delay in the middle of the project development. The worst bad POC scenario is to find out you did not test an SDK or another ability properly and finding out there is a major performance problem or limited functionality which limits the main functionality of your project and jams it. This actually happened to me recently in a peer-to-peer -peer video conference project as I found out the performance of the video solution I chose is not good enough to host the number of people the project was supposed to handle, forcing me to make a mid-project pivot. So, the bottom line. First, prove the concept of your app and then move on to the next stage.